Coach, uh, getting the football, I mean, you had two devastating losses last year to Texas and Baylor, but outside of that, you ended the season, I think it was like on a four-game winning streak, particularly in the Super Bowl against Alabama. I want to know what that feeling was like for you, not necessarily to win a bowl game because you're accustomed to doing that, uh, but really beating Alabama, an SEC school, when so much was made about the SEC, and you were one of the individuals, if I recall correctly, that, that spoke out in, in terms of reminding folks, excuse me, SEC isn't the only place where college, big-time college football exists. I want to know what that was like for you to end the season on that note last year. Well, I, I, I appreciate you bringing it up, Stephen A., and I have to be honest, uh, it, was, it, it felt good, it was positive, because I know everybody's screensavers, everybody had their notes down, everybody was ready to jump on us, on me, uh, in particular on what I had to say if it went the other way. Uh, and that, that, that all had to be deleted and uh, yeah. there's a little bit of, uh, a little bit of validated in what I had to say and, and fortunately it worked out in a positive way and, and I still believe in what I said. Uh, at the end of the day we can play with anybody and uh, that was fairly evident. So in that game, your but young quarterback. So, go ahead, Stephen A. No, I was saying, yeah. I was saying, but more so, like you said, more so than just your school. You seem to be wanting to send the message on behalf of so many non-SEC schools. That's a great. That, excuse me. Th go that's ahead. a great that's, point. That's the point I was asking. I heard from more Texas high school coaches how pleased they were on how that all went because we go down there, of course through Texas, Oklahoma recruiting at how I was surprised at how many Texas high school coaches pulled me aside because they felt validated uh, because half of our roster or more are, are kids from Texas that we've got good football players too. And, and in the end, at the end of the day, there's not a lot of difference between the top schools in each conference. Uh, and, and at the end of the day, that's, uh, they were really pleased that it, it happened the way it did, and it sort of validated that area of the country.